Right, here we go then guys, out with Scrappy, and uh, I've had a lot of blanks man, but I'll just quickly show you where I'm to. I've been on a proper blanking mission, come on Scraps, oi, over here, sorry he's wandering off, yeah proper blanks man, I went to sheer water and blank, that was special, broke my rod, forgot to bring my float rod, honestly it's been a right uh, disaster the last couple of trips, so I haven't posted a video, it's not that I've been able to, I've had four blanks man, I caught a couple of carp, on the float um, at my local park lake but some guy ruined the video <laughs> was talking away through it just stood behind me but i will post it up so you will see a couple of carp i caught on the float but you see some random guy netting them <laughs> um i'm walking through a swamp at the moment scrappy's fascinated and uh, we're going to go for some pike today uh ditch fishing just going to wander around just want to chill with my dog and i want to catch some fish to be honest with you um i don't want to cut fish cut fishing's been doing my head in <laughs> i can tell by all the groups quite quiet at the moment um even when i was at shearwater only a few fish come out so uh, I'm going to find a little spot and uh, me and Scraps are going to get on the pikeys. I've even got loads of worms with me today, so I might try worms. Um, it's really murky, the water, so hopefully if I get some worms out, I might give it a go. I'm just going to blast about a good couple of hours. Let's get on it. Bing, bang, bosh. Beesh. All right, here we go then, guys. I'll show you what I'm doing. So I've got a really bright lure today. I got this off my mate Steve from Lake to Lake live streams. I put a worm on tail on the end of it just to give it a give a little bit of extra movement. Could even catch a roach on that bad boy. But as you can see, it's bright, so you can see it. I'll give it a couple of casts there, and then we're going to move around and just see how we get on, basically. Yeah, the lake's been drained, uh, been dragged, so this is why it's no reason. guys this is the bit i think is going to be the most productive on this part of the section blanked on that last bit um, this is a bit dirtier but i'm hoping this standout lure is gonna gonna produce a fish i'm standing right up on the bank here just so i didn't get too close down the bottom because uh obviously i've got no cover anymore no reeds I think there's a small fish down there. Alright, I've changed the lure just for because it's so bright. Change the lure. And I'm in. That's weird. That's good fishing, man. Down here. Right. Just down here. What is going on? Look at this, man. That is a good pipe. There's a little ditch, change of lure, nearly paid off. Right. I'll turn you back around again. Sorry guys. Smash that. 
but out of a little ditch. Look at that. Absolutely booming, man. Booming, absolutely buzzing. Took me literally, wouldn't come in. It's covered and covered and covered in leeches. Uh, madness, obviously I let the pike go. He was about seven or eight, I reckon. He was really fat. And I mean, um, when I had, I had to cut my net as well, to get the trebles out. I mean, I've never seen any fish covered in leeches so much, honestly. So that fish had been let up for ages because of all the rain. Um, and this is the lure what got it, Steve Cottis at Live to Live Lake Streams. But this fish swallowed that lure and that trace. Literally, like the trace was just sticking out there. So I don't know how people fish with fluorocarbon for pike, man, because that would have just got bitten straight off. It literally went right up to the mouth. I've never seen that. And that's because when I cast it out, I didn't even think, obviously, the a fish must have just grabbed it straight away and I sort of was reeling it and because the lure does that, I thought I thought that was just it and then I felt a big junk and I thought, oh my God, that's a fish on. Um, so yeah, obviously, and that fish just took me like halfway across this little ditch um, and that is a big fish for a little ditch, what anyone says. It again, yeah. Right, I've literally, I've only got about another five casts here and then I'm gonna move to another ditch, but and look, funny to run off with my sock. It's what I put over my rods, so he just keeps grabbing it for attention and runs off. <laughs> he was so funny when I had that pike there. He was running up and down like a lunatic. It wasn't the best filming because you can imagine it took me up and down the river and I had it zoomed in, so I had to zoom back out. Oh, just blah, blah, blah. Anyway, yeah, boy. Pike, where's my sock? Where's the sock? Where is my sock? You took it. You did, you took it. Where is it? Where did you put it? Tell me where the sock is. Where's the sock? Get your sock. Hit the sock. Find my sock. I like that sock. Get. A new scrap. Where is my sock? <laughs> All right. Gonna get to another bit. Lake to lake live streams. Lake to lake live streams. I'm such an idiot, man. I'm admin on that group. <laughs> right. Anyway, I'm gonna chuck this out there and we're gonna catch a pike. Oh, this is where I blanked earlier with the worm lure. with this one it was a really weird take sort of grabbed it and then i sort of like felt a fud and then saw it went off but he's covered in leeches and lices he had a leech on his eye what i took off i'm gonna give him a good rest and get him back in it's on the wet grass as you can see and straight in there get him in the lake in the river in the ditch <laughs> Guys, just as I was about to talk, I've got a patchy helicopter flyover. Yeah, well, I'm next to an airfield, which you expect. Um, anyway, my old airfield. Anyway, I had a good session, only two pike today. I was hoping for more, but you see the pike, uh, the carp that I've caught now. Yeah, have a look at them. Hey, check it, fucking last time. There we go. Roll it up, roll it up, we can get more. Come on, I'll give you one. Roll it up a little bit more.
So yeah, that was a good little session on the car. Shame the guy ruined it for me. I couldn't really do anything about it. Just stood behind the swim the whole time, man. But it was a really good session. Obviously, really two really nice pipe, two nice car. Bing bang bosh, like and subscribe. I'm sorry, I'm like a one-eyed pirate, so I can't reflection off the bloody river. But little ditch. And it's scrappy, even from the Um A messy, messy scrappy. Hey, you had a good day, innit, eh? He was all tired this morning. And he was running around like a lunatic, wasn't he? Hey, had a good day, haven't we? It's been a good couple of hours. Hey, two pipe, lost one. Could have done better, I think. Um, I went to a different area, but it's just you know picking and choosing. And look at the sunshine, man! I didn't realize it was so warm today. Did we, eh, boy? It's gonna so warm. Right, Bing Bang Bosh, like and subscribe to my channel. Fighting Fisherman on Facebook, yeah, boy. And Fighting Fisherman number nine on Instagram.